Hi, welcome to another cool tool tip. In this topic, what is your brand of me? You're asked to select or create a fun image that represents your brand online. A picture tells a thousand words, but sometimes you might want to use a whole collection of words to represent your brand visually. An easy way to do that is to create a word cloud. There are many free online word cloud generators, and this is one of them. It's called Word Cloud. And there's a link to this in your learning materials. But if in doubt, Google search is always your friend. If you go into Google search and type in word clouds, see that there's a whole bunch of options that you can use to generate word clouds for free online. But back to our tool. The easiest way to use this tool is to go to the file menu and select the option to paste or type text. This will bring up this editor. You can type your text directly If you've been collecting your thoughts in a Word document, you can grab the words, use your keyboard commands to copy them and paste them into this editor. Now here's the thing about word clouds and how they're generated. You'll see in my list that some of the words that I have, like design, learning, education and art, are repeated. Word clouds work by taking the words that are repeated most often and making them more dominant in the visual representation on screen. So let's see how this pans out. I'm going to click apply. Now that's my first generation of my word cloud based on my words. But I don't have to stop there because I can go back and change the shape. And I'm going to select the speech bubble for now. And then I can change the colours by either selecting a predetermined colour theme from the theme menu or going in and changing the colours myself. Once you're happy with what's represented on the screen, we've got to download it as an image file so that we can use it on our blog post. To do that, we go to the file menu and select either to save as a PNG or a JPEG file. Both of these are image formats and we'll go into that in more detail later. You might like to also look at the size options and change the size of your image. I'm going to go with 640 by 480 and you'll see that that's slightly changed the shape of my cloud to fit within those dimensions. So back to saving it so that it's in a format that we can post in our blog. File, I'm going to save as JPEG, JPG. Then I'm going to give it a name that makes sense. Brand of me, Word Cloud, and save it somewhere on my device. For now, I'm going to save it to my desktop. And you'll see that we now have this file called Brand of me, ready to use. We can open our WordPress or Blogger page. This is WordPress. To add it to WordPress, I'm just going to click on Add, select Media, Add New, select the file from my desktop. Once it's loaded, I'm going to click the Insert button to insert that into my blog post. And there we have it. That's my first visual representation of the brand of me for my scrapbook challenge number nine. Have fun with that.